Hey everybody, I'm Zach, this is Schmirka Number, and welcome back to Slay the Spire. Today's daily is the Ironclad Sealed Deck and Blue Cards and Deadly Events. Question marks for the win. Alright. Glacier is an amazing defensive card. So is Equilibrium. One, two, three. Four, five. Uh, let's see. Six. Mm, I'd rather have Cleave, honestly. Um, let's take a boot sequence. Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Seems like a good deck to me. Let's go. Elite. We can get two, but we also want as many question marks as possible, so let's head up this side. All right. Easy. Wow. I'd rather not be made weak, so let's kill this guy. Okay, very good. Body Slam, Leap, Clothesline. We'll take a Leap. Leap's a good, very basic defensive card. I will take the Relic. It's Gyria. Let's go for extra question marks. We're not quite ready for a shop yet. All right. Yeah, that's a bummer. Okay, just fine. Feel no pain is great. I will not remove all the curses because I want those sweet curse points. Should have played Pommel Strike first, obviously. Would have been better from a damage perspective. Again, a bummer to get hit with regret there. I think we just go boot sequence clothesline here. We only have to do three damage. Yeah, we can manage. Charge battery. So we've got plenty of defense. That's for sure. Feel no pain means we win this fight. Um, and we do so without really any trouble, especially if we can get any sort of defense here, and we can. We will take damage from Regret, but not a big deal. Hopefully we can get that upgrade for, uh, True Grit soon. Okay. Um, I think we just go charge battery ball lightning. Unfortunately, we won't be at full health, but that's all right. We didn't take any damage officially in this fight, so we did get the bonus. Uh, I think a beam cell is outstanding. Cleave and Iron Wave. Couple of nice upgrades there. Good. Uh, I'll take a Melter. A little extra damage seems very nice. Let's go ahead and upgrade um, True Grit. So we can use it to hit Regret. Mummified Hand is fine. Um, and then we want Question Marks. There's a good one right now. Love it. Okay. 
I'm gonna take this extra damage while we have it. Um, let's return Beam Cell, and hopefully we can finish him off this turn. We cannot, but we can get enough block and finish him off next turn, hopefully. Yes, indeed. All right. Omamori, no thank you. Um... I think I'm just gonna take the strength boost from Giria. All right, Lagavuvu. Just definitely hoping to get, um... You know what? This is great. Uh, I was definitely hoping to draw regret there, but nothing we can do. I think a glacier here is very smart. That's 14. Um, we're going to go Iron Wave and Leap. As good as Clothesline would have been there, I'd rather take no damage. I could double play Equilibrium and take zero, but I'd rather keep this potion. All right, that's really good. Um, give me Ball Lightning and Cleave for best damage. Love it. Nice, easy Lagavulin fight. Got White Beast statue of it and a corruption. I love question card. I love an extra elite. This is great. Um, I don't think that we want corruption here, so I'm just going to true grit it. And uh, once we get to the dazes, we shouldn't be taking any damage, so nice and easy. No chance to draw True Grit, but we have the energy. We might as well draw an extra card. Actually, didn't even need to play Boot Sequence there, but it did prevent a little bit of damage for us, so that's nice. All right, another perfect, max HP. Dark Embrace. Or in flame. Um, I think we want to go in flame here. And we'll take the strength again. All right. Well, this is a just horrible start. Should have upgraded before I played Beam Cell. But that'll be fine. Uh, it would have been smarter to save Beam Cell there, actually. Again, I'm not sure that we even want corruption, but we don't have to worry about it. So, um, we can actually split you. Uh, 
All right. <clears throat> Okay, this is very nice. We can actually get spot weakness to work. Played beam cell. All right. Pretty easy, perfect there. <clears throat> and uh, I think a barricade is just really, really good for us. So we'll take that. And. Fusion hammer is kind of a tough take here. Would we rather have Sozu? I think we'd rather have Sozu. These are a couple of good potions, so. All right. Um, two elites again. Let's hit this uh, shop right here. Not the best start, but corruption is really great in this fight. Well, that is lousy. We should be able to work our HP back up, though. Should have just played the leap, honestly. All right. Um, honestly, a loop isn't that bad. The audio is doubling. Let me unmute myself here. Let me unmute myself here. Let me unmute myself here. Not a problem on my end. We will take the Relic and the Curse. I love Preserved Insect. That's terrific. Ornamental Fan is fine. Getting Barricade here is very good. A very, very easy and good fight there. I love it. Um, we'll take another leap. With Corruption and Barricade, leap is pretty good. Alright. We can grab a skill to start with. But I don't think there's anything we necessarily want. Um, I think... I don't know if any of this is particularly great. Mercury Hourglass is okay. We're not going to hit another shop. Um, champion. Maybe Amplify? We have a lot of powers, but like, only Loop, Feel No Pain, and Inflame are worth amplifying. But with Mummified Hand, maybe it's worth it. And then we can True Grid Amplify later. I guess Pummel is pretty good. We're going to take Pommel and move on. All right. We've maxed out our Gearia strength.
Might as well play Glacier to take less damage from Regret. Very, very good. Another Equilibrium, especially an upgraded one, seems like a good idea. That's still not enough block. That's crazy. These guys are so strong. Alright, could have killed you by using the attack potion, but I think the attack potion is better saved. Akabeko doesn't do much. Limit Break is so good. Eh, Regal Pillow. It's fine, I guess. An 80 damage pummel on turn one is pretty solid. <laughs> I would not mind, like, an exhume here. That would be real nice. Okay, Captain's Wheel. Very good. Uh, Reinforced Body is nice. Dude, Pummel with Akabeko, also very good. A reinforced body with barricade in particular is incredible. All right. So we've got very good strength gain. Um, I don't think we really want any of that. Okay, Distilled Chaos. Well, we can't use it. Um, disarm. Would I rather have another charge battery or even a hologram? I think I'd rather have a hologram. Yeah, that's going to allow us to build up a lot of defense very quickly. 
Um, and we're gonna smith limit break here. Limit break is gonna be what allows us to take out champion without any trouble. Can't believe we're taking a hit here for two. That's lame. The rest of this fight is very easy. Even just one limit break after getting a spot weakness or, um, dude, horn cleats like great as well. Uh, rage? Second wind, it's another way to get rid of curses. I think it's helpful. Um, I think we should make barricade more playable. Barricade is what kind of gets this deck going. That is a terrible turn, but at least he wasn't attacking. out on corruption this time around, but if we can get Barricade out, we're gonna be fine. The last card. It's not enough. All right. Okay. Um, I'm not playing Corruption because I want to keep playing Limit Break. And I'd rather not lose Reinforced Body either. I'd like to get Corruption out before I split him, if I can. Alright. We're good. Did have to use one of our potions, which is a bummer since we have Sozu. Um, but it's fine. All right, Ender Graham, what's up, man? How are you?
I kind of want a second barricade because it's imperative. But I mean, demon form is so good. And if we can play Meteor Strike, it's really good. If we get an energy relic here, I'm going to do it. All right. We could also hit it with Mummified Hand. You have interesting news. Because I kind of want to take Calling Bell. Gave us Incense Burner, which is great. Maw Bank isn't horrible. And Meat on the Bone is excellent, but we probably won't need it. Okay. Working on a side project called New Beginnings. This is uh, a Slay the Spire mod, I presume? Spend some money. Dubu doll. It's awesome. Um, we'll take uh, Dolly's mirror. And I think we should double up on a curse. Honestly. Um, curse of the Bell is the least horrible of them. And then a battle trance and another true grit. We don't want to do removal. Uh, rip and tear is very good damage, though, so let's take that. Singing bowl is fine. We just need one more curse. It's so good. Um, I love it. Okay. I am getting tired of not drawing barricade early. If we start working on max HP now, we can probably get the boost. The points boost. daisies. Um, I played Equilibrium. I think I'd rather hang on to Dark Shackles than Boot Sequence. Overly hyped for three for free pens and note-taking things. You were number six on Switch when you finished last night. Nice. New Beginning adds an unlockable alternate starter deck. Oh yeah, you were talking about that the other day. That's really cool. Oh, and a very clever name. I like it.
Looks like we're taking a hit. It's not too bad, though. Oh, let's go. All right. Pantograph. I like it. Uh, genetic algorithm probably not so good uh, at this point. A little late. Excellent. Here's an extra elite. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we've been looking for. And then the Akabeko Pummel. Just amazing. notebook-looking thing that's double-sided with a calendar in each flap and all kinds of post-it note types. Nice! I... Yeah, I like that stuff, too. Um, as a theater person, I see that stuff and I'm like, oh, this is perfect for my stage manager friend. I think we have to keep going max HP here if we want to get the bonus. Uh, heat sinks. Okay. We need one of these guys. Or one of these guys to be the tangled mass or whatever it's called. The thing that can give us a curse. We need to get to barricade as quickly as possible, so Master of Strategy is good. Love that. Bag of prep helps with that as well. Uh, overclock could help too, but let's take the max HP. And uh, smith up battle trance as well. We didn't get it. That sucks.
Um, I mean, none of these upgrades are particularly great. Don't really need it. I'm bummed that we didn't get that extra curse. Probably better to play Curse of the Bell there. Okay, we should be able to very easily get lots of block. Possibility of checking out Extravagant 2.0 today? Probably not. Um, I'm kind of obsessed with Bumbo right now. So that is probably what I will be playing for the bulk of the day. Alright, we still get Beyond Perfect here. Um, we never even used our dupe potion. All right, murderized. 1271, we could add 1371 with one more curse and we didn't even get the, that's a bummer. That's a bummer. How did we not get that? How did we not get that fifth curse? We used Dolly's mirror. Uh, we would have had 1371, which still wouldn't have been top 20. Here they are. These are the people that did the same thing as us, but got an extra curse. Eh. All right. Well, still a really fun one. That was a cool run. I enjoyed that. And if you enjoyed it, then hit that like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you later. I'll see you around. I'll see you next time. I can't wait to play more Slay the Spire, and I can't wait to do it with you. Have a great day.